Charlie and for now Tori and we are doing the loose curl tutorial on how I curl my hair like every day or not every day it's like twice a week my mom's gonna be here to curl my hair and that's pretty much it so let's get started okay so first we're gonna spray this heat protectant in my hair Oh, that stuff smells, <laughs> doesn't it? Mm -hmm. So to put the curls in my hair, we're going to use a curling wand. And my mom's going to put the link below. We got it off Amazon. Yeah, Amazon. And I got it for Christmas last year. Yep. Yeah, wait, I have my bear here. So, face this way. So I start on this side, and what I do is I take small sections of hair... Probably about like that size. And I start up at the top. Ow. And I wrap coming all the way down. Don't touch it though. And then mm -hmm. I usually count to like 20. One, two, And then I kind of hold the end of it and then I let it go like real lightly. Lightly. You don't want to just like yank on it. <gasps> Because it's best to let the curls completely dry, or like not dry, cool dry. off. It's best to let the curls completely cool off before you comb it, pull on it, comb it, anything. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Yeah, I count to twenty quickly. Not like, not really twenty oh, seconds. I count two. to twenty, pretty fast. <laughs> By then your four. hair would be fried off. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. So we <gasps> just keep going. <laughs> Don't get that so close to my face. Keep going all the way around her head. curls here and you're always curling away from the face so when you're on that side you're curling towards that the back and then when you're on this side you're still curling towards the back Ow, last piece. it better be a good one you know what one time my mom did it so we were straightening my hair before school and then because the straightening iron she's just like why won't this straighten and then, like, we ended up being, like, two minutes late because she just figured out that it was unplugged. <laughs> there. I'm getting prepared for you. <laughs> and then when she's done, she uses a pink comb to go through it. Oh. Yeah. Um, I lightly hairspray it. I <laughs> oh, use I the Spedhead that. hairspray. Um, Masterpiece, it's called. We should show them how to straighten that hair. No. Yeah. And uh, <laughs> I just lightly spray, <laughs> and it just helps the curls last longer. Oh. So then I use a pick like this, and this side might still be a little bit warm, so I'm going to start on this side, and I just real, I don't start way up here, just more like halfway through the length. I kind of just comb it out a little bit. Yeah. Turn. Just so the curls don't look too tight and put together. You kind of want it to be a little, a little bit looser. So, and then in the front, you basically just kind of want to make sure it's all <laughs> blended real well. And then, like, if you have the problem like Carly does where the sewies wants to, like, fall forward, 
what I do is uh you pin it no you can pin no, it we'll, we'll or can, kind of make sure this hair is sort of blended in with this hair so what you can do is kind of just uh, uh, tease or back comb I guess people call it your hair a little bit like that and then spray it hold on <laughs> Or kind of twirl it with the piece behind it. It'll help kind of keep it together. So, it's pretty much how it ends up looking. What do you think? How's it look? It always feels like there's more hair on this mm. side. Don't touch it. Don't touch. Mm. It does, see? Because that's more poofy. Stay down. Okay. So that's all there is to it. And actually, I like it. Yeah. If I please subscribe to our channel. And make sure you try to curl your hair like mine. <laughs> Goodbye.